can't just walk on the course and start playing. You can't walk on like it's a private country club or something. You gotta pack up your shit and, and get going. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're here at Knowles Golf Course, our home golf course here. We're playing from the red tees today because we got a tournament coming up in about 10 days. The course is pretty short there, so we decided to play from the front tees and we're just gonna go ahead and get right into it. We've got a nice easy par four here. It's about 250 yards. Very short, but that's just how it is. So let's get into it. Shit, you guys have a tea time? I do not. I know the answer to that because I've been working here since one o'clock this afternoon. You can't just walk on the course and start playing. You can't walk on like it's a private country club or something. You gotta pack up your shit and, and get going. So we are not at Knowles anymore. Uh, plans have changed and we're actually at Warren Swigart, which is part three course here in Omaha as well. Hole number two here, 113 yard part three down there. Uh, this pin location is terrible. Everything tends to go off down to the left. So I'm hoping to just take it on the right side and see if it'll come down. Diamond Beach. All right, I got a P wind here. I have it swinging about 80, 90. Okay, we're taking Jane's ball here. He put it within about 15 feet. We got our little uphill putt on this green. It's pretty terrible. Um, just gonna kind of put a left side, see if it'll trickle right in. And trickle it will do. Hole two, walked out of there with the birdie. Hole two, walked out there with the birdie. Good tee shot Jane. by Jaden. Good, good putt by there. Jake. Hole three, probably about a 98 yarder. About a 98 yarder. Gonna have to hit it nice and good, get it up on that green. Back so, it looks to slide back downhill off the front, so we're just going to attack it. Nut cam. All right, coming up the hole two here. We are one under par. Try and get another one. This is an uphill hole, 89 yards, playing 93 yards. Everything kind of runs down to the front, so you want to put it past the pin. I got a gap wedge in hand. We're going to have to hit it about 90% again, and uh, hope it gets up right next to the pin and kind of rolls back down. It should be really close to the pin. So I kind of hope that went in, to be honest with I you. I kind of hope it did too. We'll have it on video. All right, I got a 60 degree here. Same approach. I want to get it past the hole, bring it back. So I should be able to. 93 yards uphill. Go back right. Go back right. Uh, I hit that about as good as I ever can. They probably carried about 110 yards with the 60 degree shot. I'm out of seven yeah. right. Walking up to the green here. This was my shot about two feet from the hole. Looks like it just uh, pitched right there and probably rolled up just a little bit to a uh, tap in birdie there. Good shot, Jason. It's a tap in bird, two under. Hole number three here just birdied the last hole there. Jane put a phenomenal shot, a little tap in birdie for us. A 101 yard downhill shot. Uh, this green's pretty easy to hit. Just don't want to put it in the bunker. Put it on the right side, it should fall down in. I got a 60 degree in hand. Go when you're tight. Looks great. Holy center of the green. That's not bad. Dead center of the green. Like you said, 101 yards. Play a little bit downhill. I got the same gap wedge that we had on the last hole. Probably should have to hit about 85%. Last shot went pretty straight, so I'm not thinking it's going to draw in there as much as my normal shot. But This dude's insane. Five or six feet for birdie. This dude is insane. <laughs> we got this putt for birdie here. It's about six or seven feet. I think it's gonna go a little bit to the left, a little bit right to left. I don't know how quick these greens really are. We haven't putted too much on them. But uh, we're gonna see if we can put this one in here. Dude is freaking crazy. And I'm just gonna walk up and put it in, no biggie. I'm gonna go pick up the ball. Look at that, he walked away from it. I'm just gonna walk up and put it in, no biggie. Look at that, he walked away from it. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, we got hole number four here. 93, playing 88, it's another little downhill hole. I got a gap wedge in hand again. This one's gonna have to be a little bit lighter. 
probably about 80%, but uh, we're gonna try and hit the same thing. This green kind of runs to the right, so we're gonna try and put it left side and hope, hope it just runs down there to the pit. Oh, that's really left. That's actually a good kick. Kicks right, but just long. All right, same shot here. Got a 60 degree in hand. Gonna play it about 88, because just as you saw, James bounced left, but it bounced long. So I'm just gonna try and stick it middle. I really care about putting it close to the hole as much as I want it on the green. That's gonna be way long. I like that's the green. It's about stuck pin it. high. Stuck it good. Stuck it like Mike Tyson. Hole number four. Can I have a bit of 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 a bit
I had my chip shot landed about four feet to the right of the pin, rolled out. It looked a lot better, or it looked a lot worse from back there. It's actually a pretty good shot. So we got this to save par here. Looks like it's going just a little bit to the left. Kind of lag one up there, gives Dean a good line. I'm not really wanting it or expecting this to go in, but I'm gonna let her fall if she wants. Downhill, it'll be pretty quick. Curve right, curve right, curve right, get in. That's the line, just needed to go a little bit. Gosh, it feels like I hit it so much harder. Yeah, like nine divots underneath. Yeah. Just finished eight holes here weather or uh sunlight permitting we're gonna go ahead and just call it there um uh, played pretty well off the tees all things considered what how jade and i've been playing recently we haven't been playing too hot so that was a pretty good round Jaden definitely was he was lights out i was helping him on the putting green but other than that i didn't do much he was just sticking us close to giving us opportunities to putt which you know you can never be upset about so you know like i said a good round um i think next round we play hopefully we can keep that momentum going considering we just beat our record here as a scramble. So yeah, like I said, overall great performance by us. We uh, came out here and did our best. If you guys enjoy the video, don't forget to uh, do all that stuff that YouTube loves. And uh, if you guys want to see some special content like challenges or something, just leave it in the comments. We'll do anything at this point. So uh, Yeah, I mean, just like everybody else that's doing this, we're two new dudes just doing a thing that sticks. Two new dudes. Two new dudes golfing with sticks and chaffs. We like balls and chaffs. So if you guys like balls and chaffs, make uh do the things that notify things that things that are happening mm -hmm. Lots of balls and chest. see All you right. next time bye